Hi, welcome back to Sam and Glenn TV. Today we're doing a pan sheared sea scallop and with a lemon chive butter. Okay, we've used, um, I've used parsley, Italian parsley. I've used some chives, some thymes, and um, what is this again? Scallion. Yeah, a scallop. Scallion. Scallion. And um, garlic. <coughs> and in this, in this, what I did in this pan, in this bowl right here, I have finally chopped all the ingredients up, and the zest of a lemon is in here too. And right here is the butter that I have whipped. Uh, you want two sticks of butter. And if you got a mixer, it'll help if you have a mixer and you can mix the butter in. You can mix the butter till it gets nice and fluffy. It takes about a couple of minutes as because you, you want it like that right there. I let I just let mine sat out until it got nice and soft and then I just whipped it together. And we're gonna add all of this into the butter. So all the, the seasoning here in the red bowl goes into the yes, butter. With some lemon juice that I pressed some lemon juice. And everything all that goes into the butter and we're gonna uh, mix it after we do the scallop the scallops we're gonna we're gonna infuse all this together and we also have white wine so you want some wine and and we'll be back all right welcome back now we're gonna add to our butter we're gonna add uh, the lemon juice to the butter And we're gonna give it a mix. And we're gonna add this bowl of goodness that I made right here. Add all that into the butter. And you can you can freeze this butter and use it again for any Thing you want is a it's a seasoned butter. Okay. Well, that looks good and smells delicious. Oh my gosh! All those herbs, oh, the flavor, the scent is coming through. My my my. And as you can see, we mix all that together. Hi, right, welcome back. We're going to add to our mixture. We want to forget some pepper and a little bit of sea salt. Remember, the butter is unsalted. unsalted. You want unsalted butter. So you can add the amount of salt that you want into your into butter. Into the butter. Okay, we're seasoning the garlic, I mean the um, scallops, and we add salt, pepper, garlic powder, onion powder. We're waiting on the pan to get smoking hot because the pan needs to be really hot. Cooking it in the cast iron. Hi, right, welcome back. The pan is is gotta be smoking hot, and as you can see, it's smoking hot. We're just gonna drop. We have the small scallop, so we don't have the big, the real big scallop. We did the small. We did scallop. the small scallop, so we're just gonna add to the pan. And it's only gonna be for a couple of minutes, and I'm gonna even, I'm gonna turn this on to medium heat so you can finish uh, cook. So you're gonna cover the pan as much in there as you can. So 
All right, we'll be back with the finished product in a minute. Welcome back to Sam Glenn TV. As you can see, these miniature scallops, they get nice and golden brown. We're about to take these out of the plate. I'm going to pan and put it over here. Hi, welcome back. If you can see the scallops we've taken out and some of the pan thing, we're just going to take it and reserve it, pour it in a little bowl, and then we're going to go to the next step of our, our ingredients, which is the cup of Chardonnay white wine. A third, yeah, a third cup of Chardonnay white wine, and you can see. Just doing that. You gonna you just want that to cook down. You don't the uh, we want to cook down the um, the wine. The wine. You want the wine to cook down. Turn the stove. Turn the temperature down on the stove to a medium high. And you gonna get all that goodness off the bottom of the pan. Mix it in there. Yes. You just want it to cook down. You just want but a nice, good couple of spoons of this liquid after this wine is cooked down from all that goodness of flavor that was left in the bottom. And then what we're gonna do is after it cooked down for a couple of minutes, mm -hmm. right about now, you just want to take it off the heat all together. You just want to take it off the heat all together. Okay. And then now you want to use some of your butter. And in the pan being hot, that um, the butter is going to melt Quickly. into this. And like I said, you can the butter you can save if you do anything else like uh, steaks or anything, this butter go real good with it. And with the heat, with this pan is off the heat, you just want to do this right here. So you get a nice sauce. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. It smells so good. All right, welcome back. As you can see, we have our sauce, our garlic, lemon, chive, and we're just gonna drizzle it over the sound, over the scallops. Mm -hmm. Looks so good. And you want to get all of this goodness all over the scallops. Oh my God. I wish you guys can smell this aroma that is coming from this, from this plate. Okay, give it, it a is taste. absolutely gorgeous. There's a fork for you. Yeah, look at it. Oh my God, isn't that beautiful? Let's give it a taste with all that goodness on there. This is a this is a winner. I can tell you right now. If my wife ain't been here. I probably could eat the whole plate. Uh -uh. But <laughs> I'm not gonna. Oh my god, that sauce is that herb that butter is phenomenal. Please give it a try. Um, it's it's a, once you prep everything, it don't take that long to cook. So give, about 45 minutes to an hour to what that's what prep prepping time everything. everything you gotta prep every if you prep everything ahead of time probably cut the time down but anyway give it a try hit the like and subscribe button and continue to get video so you can continue to get video from us and thank you for watching 
Sam Glenn TV. Honey.